Welcome to Master Asador channel. My name is Gustavo and we're gonna cook pig's feet. We're gonna do fried pig's feet, also known in the Philippines as crispy pat. We're gonna take a pig's feet, we're gonna do a little process to uh, soften them so that they are uh, nice and tender and then uh, we're gonna end up frying. After we do all the process uh, we have to leave it, uh, you know, about a day or two in the refrigerator so that it, um, it gets a uh, you know the skin gets dehydrated and, and it gets nice and crispy outside once you have to fry them. All right so let's proceed with the ingredients. Okay for the fried pig feet or crispy pata let's call it fri frisky crispy pat because that's how we, uh, originally they call it in in Philippines so and it's their dish you know so uh, we're gonna call it like that. So we have a couple of feet, we have salt and pepper, rosemary, bay leaves, cilantro, garlic, onion, cloves, and coriander. So we're going to rub the feet with salt and pepper, and we're going to leave it in there for like about, I don't know, half hour, 45 minutes. And then the other ingredients, which are this, we're going to proceed to a, uh, put them on water. When we boil the, the feet for about three hours or so, they get nice and, and flavor from, from all this spice. Here we go with the feet. Let's have all the spices in there that we're gonna throw in here. I'm gonna drop the crispy patas. We're gonna make them crispy now. Alright my friends, here we have it. We're gonna proceed to taste it now. This is really nice and crispy. So we have this soy sauce, spicy soy sauce. Let's see how it tastes. Mm, beautiful, super tender. The vinegar and the soy sauce, it's a perfect compliment. Slightly spicy with the pepper. Check it out, so good. All these tendons and, and nerves they are just so tender and juicy. Beautiful. Please stop to do it at home. Until the next time, cheers.